this is Richard, this is Games Freezer, and today we're going to do a special unboxing. Managed to get my hands on Football Fortunes, the Kickstarter backed revamp of the Brian Clough's Football Fortunes of the 80s. So back in the day, you'd load a tape up on your Specky or your, or your Commodore 64, and that would be your accompaniment to the game. And you have your board game and everyone plays, and basically, the game on the app, in this case, or on the C64 back in the day, you calculate your um, games, scores, do the league tables for you while you play the kind of Monopoly equivalent of a football game on the board. So, this is fresh, fresh out the box. Still hasn't been uh, undone, the wrapping's still on there. So, I'm going to undo it today. Guys, app. The Football Full Tunes Kickstarter have been kind enough to send me one of these over to take a look at, so I'm really excited about this one. Um, we're going to take a look at the ball game. We've also got these special player maps that they've sent over to me as well to take a look at. Remind me of a uh, Sabutio AstroTurf pitch. I'm looking forward to opening them up. And we've also been given an additional set of player cards. Now, these are the um, 1980s classics um, football fortunes players. So on the back straight away you've got, you can see that Bruce Grobler, perfect. Five star, nice. Been wanting to open this ever since I've got it, so uh, really looking forward to this. I brought my trusty craft knife to try and get in here. Um, precision, without cutting anything or damaging anything. <laughs> Right, wrapping off, craft knife away. I don't think I'll be needing that again. Put that over there. It's down here. Right, okay, so this is the exclusive Kickstarter edition. As you can see there. So this, that's why it comes with the um, classic 1980s players as well. Right, let's open her up. what we've got. Straight away, we've got the board. That is fresh. Right, with some boards that are sort of made like this, sometimes they don't sit right. But this feels like it's absolutely perfect. Really well made. Look at that. So like I say, it's kind of a similar Kind of layout, uh, kind of Monopoly, but foot, football uh, style of Monopoly. Obviously, with more nuances as well, many more tactics that you can employ to win a game. Right, so let's have a look at some of the spaces on the board, shall we? So, on there, you've got things like uh, manager's luck, free agent, managed staff, selection problems, wages, crisis, sponsorship. Uh, international break, kind of in the corner there. Maybe that's kind of where the uh, free parking is on a Monopoly board. There's the kickoff square, which is where you start. Uh, visit the academy. So plenty of things to uh, take into consideration on your journey around the board. Then on the middle, you've got the academy there. Uh, free transfer pile. And also a ready retina for a team rating total and wages, which comes into play, I think, when you have to pay out wages um, against the, the players that you have got. You've also got a scouting trip on there. I didn't see that one. The binoculars. Right, okay. So far, so good. It looks really well made. Nice fold-up ball that goes into a small enough um, package that you could carry that around quite easily to a mate's house. Right. Now we've got the counters. Not sure what these are used for yet, but there they are, fresh, unpopped, made out of nice thick card. Looking good, good quality, great stuff. I mentioned it before, but it looks as though uh, these guys here have done a grand job of a Kickstarter and have done it right and haven't cut any corners um, to produce this absolutely fantastic looking board game. A labour of love, definitely. And there you go, there's the uh, 
the other counters. I think the player counters are in here as well, different coloured shirts, kind of on the middle row of who you can um, choose to be. Um, again, looking forward to uh, getting stuck in with those and working out what they are. Right, next up, money, money, money. I might um, open this actually. Football Fortunes, five million. So that's a denomination of five million. I'm assuming that's the highest denomination. Let's have a, let's have a quick peek. Maybe it goes up to 50 million, I don't know. Maybe it comes down to one. So we'll look, cut the trusty craft knife out again to get into this pack without doing any damage. Precision instrument. Right, here we go. This is what Spurs need in a minute. Bit of Wanda. Spin it in the transfer market. Loads of money. Right, okay, what we got? We've got five million. Pinks, oh, it goes up 10 million. Blues, 20 million. Greens, I'm assuming, are 30. The greens are 50 million. Must be purple's 100, right? The purple is 100 million. Nice. 100 million cloffy dollars. Lovely stuff. Right, okay, so that's your cash. Integral to the game. I'm assuming. Again, just like... Uh, a bit of Monopoly. Right, look at this. What we've got here. Player packs. Romeo. Hugo Lloris. Hugo. Hugo. We'll have a look at these in a minute. And then obviously I've got that other player pack as well. The, the classics. Right, so let's open them up. Let's open up the classics first. Let's see what we've got here. Come on then, what we got? Right. They seem well made. Don't want them to be flimsy ones. It's be nice card. So I have a little feel. Yeah, they're really well made. You can feel by the uh, the glossy finish to them how good they are. So Bruce Grobelar, Neville Southall. All our five-star keepers, Ray Clements, Peter Shilton, Chris Woods, four-star, Jim Layton, John Lukic, now we're into the three-stars, Chris Turner, anyone? Dave Besson, I, would have, I think I rated him higher on the Kickstarter um, Facebook page. Um, three-star, I reckon he's a four-star. Nigel Spink, I would have said four-star. Steve Sutton, Steve Grizovic, three-star, I'd say four-star. But this is all subjective. Bob Boulder too. Brian Gunn, what a legend too. Oh, that's, that's a bit under for him, I think. Uh, Gary Bailey, Martin Hodge, Tony Coton too. He's got to be a three. Anyway, I had my chance to vote. I might have missed out on that. Right, uh, defenders, David O'Leary, Stuart Pearce, Kenny Sampson, Terry Butcher. Oh, there's some classics in here. Let's see if the midfield has got any... Um, Classic Spurs players, because that's basically what I'm looking for there. Graham Roberts, free defender. Terry Fennett, free defender. Gary Mabbott, quality, free defender. Johnny Metgod, free. Chris Hewton, oh, it's full of Spurs here. Alvin Martin, Kevin Moran, all right, okay. Pat Van Den Al, ooh, Pat Van Den Al. Say, ooh, Pat Van Den Al. Stevie Wicks, right. Actually, defenders, classics, right? Midfielders, here we go. Sunez, Dalglish, Reed, Glenn, Hoddle, God, uh, Brian Robson, Chris Waddle, FFFF, Chris Waddle. Uh, what else we got? Paul Strachan, Ricky Villia, four star, Ozzy Ardiles, four star, Ray Wilkins, Ronnie Wheelan, John Robertson, John Walk, Kevin Sheedy, oh, yes. Some absolute legends. Any more Spurs? That's basically what I'm looking for. Paul Allen, two star. I would have given him three, definitely. Uh, Stuart Robson, Vinnie James, two star. Right, here we go. The big guns. 
Bum bum. Gary Lineker, five star. Spurs legend, Everton legend, Leicester legend, Barcelona legend, Manchester Day legend, England legend. Uh, who else have we got here? Clive Allen, four star. 49 goals in a season. Thank you very much. And uh, who else have we got? Short John Aldridge, Bob Clare, John Aldridge, Ross, Kerry Dixon, Mark Haightley. He go to Monica. Did he go to Monica? Mark Haightley. Um, Steve Archibald will take more care of you. Archibald, Archibald. Paul Walsh, Paul Walsh worm burners. Oh, he's a great. Rolling back the years here with plenty of great players. Any other classics? Cotty, Tony Cotty too. Adrian Heath, Paul Mariner. Even around Terry Gibson. Right. Classic, absolutely classic players. Love it, love it. Right, let's just open up these last two packs. I won't go through everyone, but I just wanted to check out the 80s classic players there. And let's see what we got here. Sorry, more care review. Archibald, Archibald. We'll take more care of you, Archibald, Archibald. There we go. Right, I'm in. Player cards. Red player cards, player cards. Nice. The hay and Lewis. Lovely. Good stuff. Plenty of mixes and matches to be had with all of your cards. Bring in a team of world beaters. So that's that stack. I won't mix it up with the 80s ones. And these are the youth player cards, which I believe you can bring into your squad and build up your youth players. Improve their stats, I think. I haven't played the game yet. Um, knew of the game when I was younger, but never had the opportunity to play it. And now I've got the opportunity to play it, I can't wait. Hence why I've done a, a nice um, unboxing video, because I couldn't wait any longer. Oh, here we go. Right, so what I've done here is we've got the youth players, I think. Oh no, we haven't got youth players yet. Right, sorry. They are player cards, so there's more player cards there. They're all two star. Okay, then we got coach cards, which I think are um, Kickstarter backers names. I think. And then you've got a scout, scout card. Okay, scout card. Then you've got a youth player card. Again, I think these are um, backers of the uh, Kickstarter who went for that tier. Yeah, all the way through, youth card, right. There you go. So that, my friends, is Shalot. Right, let's have a look at these player mats. Now these look really cool. Like I said earlier, they look like and remind me of the Sabutio AstroTurf pitch. And when you get them out, oh yeah, they're really solid. They're nice, nice weight to them. Almost like a mouse mat, if I'm honest. So on the actual um, mat itself, you've got spaces for your uh, unavailables, uh, formation, defense, attack, Scout on the bench, on the bench. So I'm assuming you get two defenders, um, two substitutes. Plus defence coach, plus attack coach. And then the pitch, I think, to lay out your players that are playing. So as you've always got that um, visibility of who's in the team. So as you can work that out any time. But the actual mats themselves, like I say, are really well made. Like a rubber back into them as well. Excellent. Like a really well made product. Again, let's just open the other one. Take a little peek. 
Let me go that slot. Perfect. Really can't wait to get playing it. I'll let you know how I'll get on. I'll put another video on. Until then, take care my friends. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.